Hey guys, I want to talk about um, one of my favorite products on the planet. And coming from me, that's a big thing. I'm both picky and I've heard everything by now, but um, I touched on it when I was at Cedia. I went to Cedia. I was in a demo, uh, Pro Audio uh, Technology and Theory Audio Designs. I was in this demo and it was a half an hour. It was a big demo. It was a lot of my time um, taken up there. And when I left there, I was floored and it changed my mind of how an in-wall can sound. I still hang on to the fact that in walls don't sound like floor standing speakers and vice versa and, or, you know, and all that kind of stuff that I talked about. Um, but I'm talking about every other brand when I say that now. They literally just changed my mind. Um, and like the reviews say, I said the same thing without even reading the reviews. It's not inexpensive, um, but it is far times far more money than it's worth. Um, you know, just, just to give you an idea, they, in theory audio, which is what I'm going to, um, which is what I'm going to, uh, review right now because I'm putting pro audio in the room next door and then we'll do a full review of that. But theory, it's a company by a guy named Paul Hales. Paul Hales is an old two channel guy that made really, really high end two channel speakers back in the day. That was his passion. And, um, he figured out how to basically make a compression driver like a, that, that would be an Eclipse speaker, also audiophile. The very first demo they played me, um, at Cedia was a an in-ceiling speaker and they told us they're gonna listen to these two in-ceilings with no sub so we're all sitting there kind of like who why would we even do that who cares and he turns on um, these bones and by the Fairfield 4 and the voices the clarity the pronunciation the detail and the depth was all there and it's a six and a half inch in-ceiling speaker um, you know, I, I don't really know what to say. I, like my friend swore. I mean, he literally cursed next to me. I mean, we looked at each other and he said, that's effing crazy out loud. And he has a very deep voice. What's up, Justin, if you're listening. Um, and you know, we just kind of looked at each other in disbelief because I raised my hand after and I said, Hey, uh, how much is that? And he said, $675, $675 for the speaker that I heard that put my jaw on the ground, basically. Um, you know, I had never heard anything like it, especially not for that price. Sorry, we actually do run a company out here. People don't know how to be quiet. Blah, 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 blah. Audio, video, audio, video, blah, blah, blah. All right. So, um, this is a very serious demo because I couldn't, you know, I don't have room for a full theory system in here yet. We've got to pull the screen down. I've got to find a, there's nine speakers behind the screen already. Um, but I needed to let people listen to it. A um, couple stories. I sold it to a guy sight unseen just on my excitement of it, okay? And um, he, he will probably watch this, so what's up, Chris? Um, he bought it sight unseen, but he came in here, and uh, right when I put the just the two channel, so I, I put two speakers and a sub in here, and he was, like, nervous. I was nervous because he already bought it, and it just wasn't installed yet. All It was all here already. I paid for it. Um, and he's sitting there and afterwards he was just like, dude, you did not steer me wrong. Holy crap. Like he was 10 times more excited after listening to it. The guy next to him, just cause they were there at the same time. And coincidentally, they're both doctors and they both work for the same group and all this stuff. So it was really funny. I mean, he bought it immediately. Uh, my neighbor who I can't say his name, he owns a large a AC company. He came in to pick up. These are true stories. I swear to my kids, he came in to pick a, pick up a projector pole. So he already has a full theater system and all this stuff. And we were, he was just picking up a pole because it's a high ceiling that he was moving to. And, um, so I go, Hey, or he says, Hey, one day I'll upgrade, you know, more stuff. I've already got a black diamond. I'm going to upgrade my audio and stuff like that. And I was like, Oh, I just got these speakers and you should come hear them. Um, and then like when you want to upgrade, maybe you want to upgrade to these. He literally dropped 25 grand in the next 20 minutes and left. And we're doing his whole theater over just from listening to them. Um, do they sound like a $300,000 Focal Utopia? No, but do they not sound that good? No, like they sound so good, they shock me. And so I would, I would tell anybody to come in here and listen to these things. Um, they're so detailed and so pronounced and so powerful that it makes you feel like, um, like a gunshot sounds like a gunshot, you know? Glass sounds like glass, but then a guitar sounds like a guitar. I mean. They have like all oh, Sonus Faber quality audio, audiophile sound in an in wall. I, I just don't get it. 
Um, you have to hear it to believe it. I think you should. I want you to get a close up of these things because they're, I mean, there's nothing special about them. I mean, it's an in wall at the end of the day. It's got some dumb string on here that I can't really <laughs> figure out. I'll try to hold it to the side. It's a compression driver. It's two, I think, five and a quarters and ported. It's sealed. So that's good. I mean, it's basically a high end bookshelf. Um, but the way that uh, Paul designed these, he owns uh, Pro Audio Technology, which, in my opinion, is probably. After hearing them, uh, I flew out to Santa Ana on Friday, and I did their whole experience center. If you're in California, I'll tell anybody to go do that. Um, I heard a quarter million dollar theater. I heard a hundred, hundred ish thousand dollar audio system there. Um, but the Pro Audio stuff is, I mean, it was like listening to commercial grade theater speakers. Um, they're in half of the A listers houses. Um, you know, one of them, uh, just so you know, is like the daughter of this lady and guy that was in the Olympics and they're very famous. Some sisters, some sisters, you might know who I'm talking about. Um, you know, like houses like that are what pro audio is in and it's not by far not the most expensive speaker made. So just the pedigree alone was, was shocking, um, of who owns these things and whose homes they're in and stuff like that. But, um, he wanted to make a more accessible from a financial standpoint residential version so enter theory so in here we've got two speakers and a 12 inch sub nothing crazy believe it or not it's run off of this tiny little uh, 250-4 amp the thing weighs about as much as the remote control on top of it it's digital i would in my head i want to say it's cheap but more power comes out of that thing than any surround sound receiver i've ever heard at any price level um and it's not power that's bad it's it's just got detail and dynamics that is unmatched, unmatched of anything that I've heard in a theater. Um, I put together four or five systems already with this system. You're running about 30 grand um, for a full seven channel, two sub projector screen install. So it's a $30,000 theater to get into theory, um, worth every single penny. My guys put it in, um, last week our our very first one and, and the guy, that guy chris's house and literally uh, my installer wrote me and he said that room is badass i mean he doesn't write me stuff look he installs my stuff every day so you know for him to write that it's special and different was just shocking so um you know you do want to probably start getting in some room acoustics and stuff like that but um it is definitely something to look into if you haven't looked into it uh we are going all the way deep we're doing a 5.1.2 in here of theory in the next room we're putting together a full pro audio system um with uh with room acoustic stretch fabric uh the whole nine yards in there and that's under construction now so when that's done we will have theory and pro audio here in our dallas showroom but even just this two